to just see me this morning trying to organise my outfit. I had like 17 outfits on the bed. I was like, but this one, but this one. That was Price Tag yeah. by Jesse J. I'm Larry Flick here on Sirius XM OutQ. I feel like I've been dying to meet you for I was saying, years. I didn't even realise, Mr. Flick, it's an honour to be here. It is really, really nice to talk to you. And you. You're very glamorous. Thank you. This is my, my daytime wear, which is... You know. I know, where's the, where's the, <laughs> the lipstick and the... Uh... I know, I feel like people are disappointed when they meet me and I don't have like crystals stuck to my mouth. It feels amazing to feel like, you know, the UK is where I'm from, you know, I'm British and I kind of, even though I signed in the US, I was so thankful that I was allowed to kind of release in the UK first because that's where you start and the UK is like middle school in comparison to the US so it's kind of... It feels great that I've kind of got that home support and that I now feel like I feel a lot stronger and a lot more comfortable to go out and fly the flag around the rest of the world knowing that when I go home that people understand me and my music's there and living and breathing and you know people have my album and my singles and yeah it's good it's good it feels it's just the most humbling feeling. What's it like to you know finally put out your own album and, and have it so you know quickly taken in by the pop masses? Um, it's been an incredible few months like it feels like I've had 10 years career in one week <laughs> it felt like everything just went but I'm doing Saturday Night Live I was gonna ask how uh, exciting right? I'm so excited oh. BAB's coming over to do it oh he's gonna be there yeah I mean, I went to the Brit School and I did musical theatre, but Adele, Katie B, um, Rox, they were in music and I was in musical theatre, so it was in different strands. But yeah, I was I was friends with Adele and we used to like sing at lunchtime together and someone would be playing guitar and yeah, it was fun. She's in the building, Jesse G is in the building. I think it's good to sometimes go, you know, haha, you didn't believe as who I am, living my dream and doing what you said I wasn't good at, you know, I wasn't allowed in the school choir, I didn't do plays at school because I wasn't really kind of, didn't feel comfortable to be accepted and not everybody likes my voice and people used to tell me to be quiet and, you know, and laugh at my songs when I write songs and it's for all those people that didn't believe, I think that a song lasts forever. It's the best up yours that you can possibly give. <laughs>